But Howard Gay, Howard's not an issue. You know, that's the past. That's all gone. But old news was bad news for Maurice Ferre, and we saw it clearly in our exit polling. Take Precinct 469, for instance. We talked with almost 100 voters there yesterday, and 56% of Suarez voters cited the Gary firing as a factor in their vote. The figure was even higher, 64%, among those who backed Arthur Teal the first time around and switched to Suarez. In Little Haiti, observers from both sides of the mayoral race said the Gary issue was magnified for Maurice Ferre because Joe Carroyo was on the ballot at the same time. Ferre and Carroyo were two of the three votes to fire Howard Gary back at that emotional commission meeting three years ago. Maurice, you know, locked himself up with, some, with a heavy bullet on his neck and he drowned. And the bullet was Carroyo. Because when they link up with Carroyo, and a lot of people going after Carroyo neck and grab Ferre at the same time. Despino says distributing combined Ferre Carroyo flyers was a big election day mistake. And in looking at the black vote, what about the Yahwehs? Their leader got heavy applause from Suarez backers. Know that I have 4,000 supporters in this city, and those 4,000 supporters voted silently, but together as one. Of course, up at Dade's elections department, they don't have any figures on voters' religion, so it's hard to tell if Yahweh's claim is accurate. But his very presence at the Suarez soiree indicates that politicians will give the benefit of the doubt to a man that some voters think is God. Nick Bogert, News 4.